Hey guys. Pop. It's the non-log. It's not even, I don't know what it is. It's boring and it sucks, so just turn it off now. So, I just was in the news looking at a couple things that piqued my interest. Katie Holmes' excessive PDA lately is interesting to me. Provocative. I like it. And she deserves it. We all know with Tom Cruise, they were everywhere and he was jumping on the couch and doing all that. And then since then, with Jamie Foxx or any boyfriend, it's just night and day. They don't do anything. Not night and day, the Tom Cruise movie. Let's look at a clip. <laughs> but night and day meaning there's nothing going on. She just cannot, I don't think she can expose her dating life, which my Clouseau instincts feel like there's something fishy going on there. And then this new guy, it's fucking French Atui. It's really like tonsil hockey. I mean, good for her, but now something's different and she's going for it. It's like the deep dive tongue thruster diaries because if you see she's on park benches making out every day, like the park bench make out is a little tough side to side, but good for her. Like she's like, fuck it, man, I'm going for it. So she is getting it. She's doing, I'm sure there's some grinding. It's all high school again. It's like at the door and there's some friction and there's some, you know, his Levi's are getting a five button stress test, if you know what I mean. <laughs> it's always the mask down make out to prove. You have to prove this if you're sort of in the know or the celebrity world. You have to prove to people, I do have it on, I do know, because people go, what the fuck is the Katie Holmes doesn't have a mask on? So she goes, have it on, pulling down two French. And everyone's like, oh, wow. But Katie, good luck and hit that shit. Girlfriend. My mom wants me to do all these charities. My mom wants me to do charities and then she says, oh, Davey, it's for the dogs. And then she always has like cockamamie ideas. I go, mom, maybe I could call someone for 30 seconds. She's like, oh, who wants that? I go, she goes, maybe you get Justin Bieber and you can get a hot air balloon ride and take some fans out and then they'll pay. People would pay $500 for that. I go, I fucking hope so. Jesus, mom. She's like, maybe you, and you can get Keanu Reeves. Everyone loves him. He's everyone's favorite. He's got long hair and he looks sort of like mixed race. So everybody likes him. And I think you said you knew him or you dropped that name on me one time. You tried to bombard me with it, but you know, I never fact check if you even know these people, but you said you went scrunchy shopping with him, which sounds like a lie. But call him, because you said he's your best friend, and then maybe like ride motorcycles. Know, put him on the back and do a wheelie, get a sissy bar so it's safe. Do something, it's for dogs. People would pay $300 for that, I know, maybe more. So we settled on a FaceTime with me. She's like, ugh. <laughs> she goes, you're not gonna do like, your act and work your dumb jokes. And I go, no, I'll just sit quietly. She goes, okay, good. Maybe you can FaceTime Keanu Reeves. Uh, side note. I talked to a buddy today who's obsessed with Sully. Remember Sully Sullenberg? His name is Saul Sully Sullenberg Sullenberger Gerger. <laughs> <laughs> so fucking dumb. Um, sorry, you're already in it. You're in the monologue. Can't get out now. There's no way you can press pause. So Sully, he was so into him because he was such a hero and all he cared about was the fame aspect. He goes, Dude, Sully could fuck anything for one week after. Up to a month, he could fuck literally. I'm like, why do? You, why would you say, the guy's 170. He goes, no, no, he could tap any puss in the Hudson River area within circumcision of a mile of the Hudson. I go, is that the word? He just peacocks around that terminal. I, could, I would too. If you're Sully and you just landed it, you wear the hat back a little bit so you know it's him. Sully, make it a little bigger. Walking down, what's up gals? Terminal, ooh, ooh. puffing the feathers. Hey gals, what's up? What's your name, huh? Hey, look out for some birds. I'm kidding, I'm kidding. <laughs> uh, what's your name? Oh, where do you work? Delta, I know Delta, I know some people over there. Yeah, maybe I'll call them. Those birds were fucking crazy, don't get me going. Oh, everywhere. I was like, oh, anyway, put it in the river and we'll fucking Miller time. Okay. <laughs> Chapstick break. <laughs> mango sunrise, folks. More like mango sunset, but 
still do it. So I read about someone else starting an OnlyFans. Heather, how's my OnlyFans coming along? Mm. Everything <laughs> but the wiener picture. Here's the point of OnlyFans. I predicted this last year. I said, people are going to go to porn because there's nowhere else to go. There's 10 million bikini models. They all look great. And with filters, they all look even better. Like, everyone looks perfect. So who really looks real, who cares? Who really looks great, who cares? This, when you see it this way, it looks perfect. And the bikinis are so small. Where do you go? How do you stand out? You got to start something different or just full nudity. Because right now it's just barely covering the boobs and then the paper cut. You know what I mean? So boobs we've seen, paper cut. I mean, it's just not, it's not that exciting anymore. So you got to up the ante all in and then it goes to, I've seen a lot of leaked wiener pictures. Folks, I like Tiger's going to do, Tiger, sorry, is going to do only fans. <laughs> And in a crazy series of events, the day he's doing it, he leaks a wiener picture. Now, I didn't, that didn't add up to me because first of all, that's the thing you say to come on the OnlyFans to look at. But to leak it, and of course, it's always some guy with a donkey dick leaking it. It's never little wieners. You never hear about somebody with a little wiener getting leaked and hacked because then there'd be some scrambling in Hollywood. It'd be like shut down the whole internet. The whole thing, yeah. Boom, boom, boom. All right, let's think. <laughs> Because that's real. These guys are all leaking it. It's so stupid. So there's girls doing it now and they better be naked. Like well, the guys too. Like, why are we going over there to hear your innermost thoughts? We see them anyway. That's all I'm going to say about OnlyFans. Now it's time for a little mango. Get the teeth. Let's be honest. I'm two paychecks away from going on Chatterbait. Good news, good news. <laughs>